ANC leader Musalia Mudavadi now claims that Ray Odinga became a political lone ranger, shortly after the 2017 general election, and unilaterally made decisions without consulting the other principals within NASA. In his just published memoirs, Mr. Mudavadi says they were all shocked when Mr. Odinga, out of the blue, formed the National Resistance Movement, NRM which was taken over by controversial lawyer Migana Migana to prepare for Mr. Odinger's swearing-in as people's president. Mr. Mudavadi, then a key ally of Mr. Odinger, says Mr. Migana's entry into NASA activities was mysterious and disruptive of the smooth running of the post-2017 general election affairs of the coalition. I must emphasize, NRM was not a creation of NASA, nor was it a NASA organ. It was just as mysterious to me as was the manner in which it was first introduced to Kenyans. So, too, was the sudden emergence of Migana Migana the NRM general, Mr. Mudavadi writes. In soaring above the storms of passion, Mr. Mudavadi traces the controversial lawyer's return to ODM leader Rayla Erdinger's fold to a rally on October 25, 2017, a day before the repeat presidential election. It all started on October 10 when Mr. Odinger pulled out of the second presidential race after the first one was nullified by the Supreme Court and announced that he had an earth-shaking message which he would unveil on October 25. I did not know what this earth-shaking message was. I established that none of the other three principals knew it. And so like the rest of the country, we waited for October 25, 2017, Mr. Mudavadi writes. He says he nonetheless rallied behind the decision of their candidate even though not all principals were in support of pulling out of the election. Apparently, the withdrawal had been hinged on the Electoral Commission's statement earlier that only Mr. Kenyatu and Mr. Odinger would be eligible to take part in the repeat poll and NASA believed that if they pulled out, the election would not take place. But a day after Mr. Odinger withdrew from the race, the High Court ruled that the repeat ballot must have all the names of the people who had participated in the annulled poll. It would be dishonest to say that this situation did not throw us off balance. We may have put on brave faces in public but internally we knew things were not good at all, he writes. The withdrawal was to become a bone of contention within the coalition in the intervening days. Some of the NASA lawyers who pushed for participation in the October 26th poll argued that after the Supreme Court win, the momentum had been built and that rigging would not have been possible. October 25th, 2017, a day before the repeat poll, our supporters began turning up very early in the morning for our much-anticipated rally at Uara Park. Kenya held its breath, waiting for us to unveil our next course of action writes Mr. Mudavadi.